Westminster Abbey. This most historic church in the English-speaking world is where kings and queens have been crowned and buried since 1066. While it was first built in the 11th century, much of what we see today is 14th century. When there's a royal wedding, the world looks on as, amid all this splendor, thousands of Britain's glitterati gather under these graceful Gothic arches. The centerpiece is the tomb of Edward the Confessor, who founded the Abbey, and surrounding Edward are the tombs of 29 other kings and queens. This is the tomb of Queen Elizabeth I. Her royal orb symbolizes she was queen of the entire globe. The Abbey is filled with the remains of people who put the great in Britain. Saints, musicians, scientists, and soldiers. For lovers of English literature, strolling through Poet's Corner can be a pilgrimage in itself. King Henry VII's Lady Chapel, with its colorful windows and fanciful banners, has the festive air of a medieval pageant. The elaborate ceiling is a fine example of fan vaulting, a style that capped the Gothic age. At the far end, a wall of modern stained glass marks the Royal Air Force Chapel. It honors the fighter pilots of all nations who died defending Britain in 1944. With saints in stained glass, heroes in carved stone, and the remains of England's greatest citizens under the floor stones, Westminster Abbey is the national church and the religious heart of England. <laughs>